Hello guys! So today guys, we're gonna test the SL in street photography. Again guys, this is the uh, Leica SL Type 1 601. So it's been uh, 5 years I think, or 6 years since they released this uh, Leica SL. But today guys, we have the SL Type 601 with the Sigma 24 1.4. So like, let's take some uh, photos in street. So let's go and take some street photos. And it's raining guys. Yeah. Ito, medyo palpak ang ating street photography today because it's raining. So, tinan natin humupa na lang tong ulan. Yan. Basa basa pa ang ano. Oh. Yan, humulan pa guys. Medyo, yan. Sablay ang ating street photo ngayon. So, tingnan lang natin. And guys, so it's Malas Day. So yeah, because I reach already in the Kuwait City. It's already dark, guys. So and it's been 5 p.m. but medyo madilim na so I don't have uh, too much photos for my camera <laughs> using the like a uh, SL for street photography but still I, I managed to take some photos for night photography so yeah and when I got it again for uh, shooting at night I like the Sigma 24 1.4 Sigma 24 1.4 and uh, of course the camera so it's good for street but it's bulky guys it's more bigger uh, camera I mean with the 24 art lens I think it's huge for scene photography uh, rather to use my Fujifilm uh, X Pro 2 or the Leica Q or the X100V yeah the Leica uh, sorry the Fuji X100V the X Pro 2 or the Leica Q which is I've already planned to uh, to do a comparison between Leica Q and like ISL, but unfortunately, uh, it's raining here in Kuwait and it's too dark already. So, yeah, by the next time, guys, we will make a comparison between these four camera. Yeah, these four camera, guys, uh, because most of this uh, camera, two of my camera, sorry, two of this camera is already fixed lens with the 23 and 28 uh, lens, fixed lens, and we have the X Proto, which is 23. Uh, millimeter uh, focal length and from the Leica SL which is 24 1.4 so we will do a comparison side, side by side comparison with these four camera guys uh, yun, two from Fuji and two from the Leica but today guys ayan, pasensya na I don't have too much uh, photos took from the Leica SL but have some yeah, night photos so ayan, check na lang guys and again guys so ayan Still, I want to do more uh, street photography for the Leica SL. Yeah, maybe a couple of days, guys. Or uh, yeah, another street photography for the Leica SL. But today, fortunately, it's raining <laughs> outside. So I don't have too much shots with the Leica SL. And it's already 5 p.m. Di ko na tancha ang araw. It's already dark here. So, yeah. But still, I like the SL, guys. So, I think for uh, 2021, if you ask, or even 2022 to December na, the like SL is still uh, 24 megapixel full frame. So what else you want, guys? Uh, for me, it's more than enough for my needs. 24 megapixel. Most of my camera is 24 megapixel. So, and guys, I think it's very good camera, guys. Even 2020, 2023, 24, 25. But the price, guys, still uh, for me, it's not uh, worth it. For the price, you have tons of uh, camera there in the market that uh, new with the new specs and new, alam nyo na technology. So, ayan. but for me, on my use, I like the Leica SL. So that's why I select the Leica SL over the X1D because main offer sa atin X1D. So, pero Hasselblad X1D. Pero I select the S Leica SL because one, the lens availability. Because the lens of uh, Leica SL is L mount. So, share from the, um, ano bang company? Sigma. Panasonic and of course the Leica Mount L. So, yeah. That's why I like the Leica SL over the X1D uh, yun, camera. Even that is 
medium format camera but still full frame is enough on guys so enough for my needs enough. so i think that's it for today guys again if you are thinking to buy or purchase the leica sl in the market use second hand marami dyan uh, type type uh, 601 it's too ayan marami sa market with the use uh, one so check in the market guys yeah so just check in the market guys if you have a good offer with the leica sl of course the body with a good condition so yeah kung suabi naman sa presyohan why not guys or if you have some friends using the like sl you can try and check nyo muna sa kanya di ba para at least alam nyo kung okay ba hindi para sa uh, photography nyo so again guys i think that's it for today flex time for us i want to flex my team which is team positive vlogger shout out to all the other team members ng team positive at syempre ang ating mga subscribers ang mga naniniwala sa atin so patuloy na nag-subscribe sa atin at nanonood sa ating channel regarding our photography and videography gears yan guys, maraya pa tayong uh, pagsasaluhan regarding photography and videography gears sa 2022 abangan natin yan guys, yung mga bagong release bagong cameras and uh, ayun, uh, flex nga pala I think we have the new Canon R3 sa AB World so check natin tomorrow and we will unbox and check natin yung camera guys so I think that's it for today ito pakita ko yung mga sample shot na nakuha natin for today and uh, yun i-flex ko lang hindi siya magsato mga ganda guys so pasensyaan nyo na guys pero ito lang na kinain natin so yan thank you and mabuhay